Hey guys, welcome back. So we've had a lot of exciting stuff happening here at the blog. Uh, today we're just going to cover the Rostock Delta build though. I've gone ahead and printed a new leg for the printer. It's the one with the fan mount in it. And I've actually had the ramps controller board show up. So what we're going to do today is actually just take a quick look at those. And I've got some other videos coming, but Today we're just going to stick to the 3D printer. So I guess first let's take a quick look at the ramps board. Alright, so here's the kit. Ordered this from uh, Gearbest. Just dump this out here. Get rid of that noisy plastic. Looks like here we have the LCD. I ordered the full graphic display. I don't know if you can see that there. It's also got an SD card reader on it. So I should be able to use this printer completely standalone from the computer. Here we have an Arduino Uno. Not a hundred percent sure but it looks like an actual real one. It's got all the uh, same markings as a real one from Arduino CC. So I was pleasantly, ex uh, pleasantly surprised to see that. Here we have the five motor controllers. They're the A4988, I believe. Come with the little heat sinks on them. Constant current drivers, so that little potentiometer is for adjusting the current. Doesn't seem to want to focus on that. Those are just plugged directly into the ramps board. As long as I plug them in the right way. Just a little uh, connector for the LCD and the two ribbon cables for it. <coughs> Power cord for the Arduino. It's the uh, knob for the LCD. And then this is actually not the ramps board. It would appear they sent me two Arduino Megas instead of the ramps board. Now these I'm pretty sure came from China and it would cost me a fortune to it would cost me some money but a fortune in time to go through sending this back and everything I have many uses for an Arduino Mega so I'm just gonna keep that and I've ordered a replacement ramps board so we don't actually have a ramps board yet we've got everything but the ramps board in terms of electronics we're still waiting on some bearings the belt and other things like that. But in terms of the electronics, we're missing the ramps board. So anyway, I've also gone ahead and yeah, I got a new workshop. We'll take a quick look at that later on. But I've also gone ahead and I've printed a new fan mount leg. This one actually takes the nice grill. I was happy about that. I wanted the grill on the first one, but it wouldn't fit. So since this one snapped, I printed it hollow. So, I kind of expected it to snap. I just wanted to make sure it was going to work and everything first. So now we've got this one. I guess it goes that way. Also, Digging through my old parts, I found this fan with blue LEDs on it, so I'm going to use this one. 
it seems to spin and push as much air as this one, or spin as fast and push as much air as this one. So it should be just fine. Anyway, let's take a quick look at printing that, and that'll be the end of this video. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Uh, you know what to do. Thumbs up if you liked it, thumbs down if you disliked it, leave a comment, all that YouTube stuff. Uh, as you saw, I got a new workshop. If you guys want, leave a comment, ask for a workshop tour. Let me know you guys want it. Anyway, have a good one guys.